Today, let's look at an unbalanced bridge circuit and let's simplify it using Thevenin's theorem and find its equivalent circuit. So we have R1 here, R2 is the 1.2 K ohms, R3, the 9.1, and R4 for the 11 K ohms, and then R5 will be this middle resistor, and that's gonna be our detector branch. So for this circuit, we have two nodes we're looking at. We have node one here and node two here. Let's find the Thevenin resistance to the left of node one. So let's take these two resistors and find their Thevenin resistance. So we'll call that RTH1. And for that, we need to take the product of the two resistors and divide it by the sum. You might also see this written out like this with two lines separating the two values. That basically means divide the product by the sum. And for this, we're gonna get 0 0.545 K ohms. That's our Thevenin resistance for that part. Let's find the Thevenin voltage for the left side of the circuit now. So our Thevenin voltage, we'll call that VTH1, is gonna be equal to 10 volts times R2 over R1 plus R2, okay? So we get 10 volts plus whoops, times 1.2K over 2.2K. And that's gonna give us 5.45 volts. Okay, now let's go to the right of node two. And let's find the Thevenin resistance between R3 and R4. We'll call this RTH2 and we have 9.1 K ohms times, where'd that go? This was 11 K ohms times 11 K ohms over 9.1 K plus 11 K. And that's gonna give us about 4.98 K ohms. And the Thevenin voltage is gonna be, let's see, 10 volts times R4 over R3 plus R4. So we get 10 volts times 11 K ohms over 9.1 K plus 11 K. And that's gonna give us 5.47 volts. Okay, now that we have our values, let's construct the equivalent circuit. So for the equivalent circuit, we have two voltage sources. So we have 5.45 volts on this side and we have 5.47 volts on that side. Then we have our RTH1, our first resistor, 0 0.545 kilo ohms. And on this side we have 4.98 kilo ohms. And then we also have to include R5, our detector branch. So that's gonna go in between, and that is 2K ohms. So we have our equivalent circuit here. Now let's see if we can find the current through R5, through our 2K ohm resistor. So our current is gonna equal, well, it's gonna equal 
V over R is Ohm's law. So our total voltage is going to be 5.47 volts minus 5.45 volts. And then our total resistance for the circuit, since we have three circuits in the series, all we have to do is add them up. 0.545K plus 2K plus 4.98K. And that's gonna give us about 2.65 micro amps. Now let's solve for the voltage through R5. So we have our current, that's 2.65 five microamps so it's going to be 10 to the negative 6 amps times R5 2000 ohms and that's going to give us about 5.3 millivolts so we just took an unbalanced bridge circuit simplified it using Thevenin's theorem and then we went ahead and analyzed the equivalent circuit. Hope this helped you out. Hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching.